Well guys, welcome back to my channel and uh, today I just want to talk about this thing called computer packages. So what are these computer packages? Computer packages are just basically the programs of computers. As you know, computer programs are 10. You are supposed to understand those programs so that it will be smooth for you to, to work with your computer. So at the end of these packages, you are uh, supposed to know how to type, how to print, how to scan, how to laminate, and how to, how to do this office uh, works. You are supposed to understand. So there are people who don't tell you this, but it is important for you to know. And what are these particular programs? Well, computer packages consist of 10 programs of the computer. Uh, when I begin to mention starting with introduction as being the number one of them is once you start the introduction to computer, you are supposed to understand the history of computer, types of computer, and many other uh, appliances as far as computer is concerned. And once you are done with that first package, which is introduction to computer, you are supposed to understand micros, uh, uh, they call it what? Windows. You are supposed to understand the Windows what program. In Windows program, you are, you are, it is just uh, an introduction for you to know the practical of the computer, whereby you are supposed to know how to start the computer, shut down the computer, how you can deal with folders, how you can change the, uh, the background, the appearance of the screen, the wallpapers, and also uh, how to draw, all are in Windows. And uh, the third package is about Microsoft Word. At the end of this, you are supposed to know how to type, how to design some simple certificates with this particular program, and how to, to print. So with this uh, program, many people use it in offices. You can go wherever you want to go in which kind of office, but you find this particular program installed in computers. Sometimes they vary in terms of versions, but it is still remains Microsoft One. And then the fourth package is about uh, uh, Excel. Well, at the, end of, uh, at the end of the day, you are supposed to understand how to calculate, how to do some accounting. So with Excel, it does, bet, it does better uh, with the, some numerical uh, calculations. You can calculate, you can do some accountings with it, and then uh, the work will be easier for you. Instead of using a phone, you can use Excel in order to do bulk uh, calculations. And then uh, the fifth package will be um, access. You are supposed to understand access uh, in terms of uh, record keeping of the company you are supposed to know how to keep records how to how, how to to do with the database management access does better with that and then uh, you are supposed to understand that is the sixth package which is a uh, uh, publisher you're supposed to know publisher publisher does uh, the work of uh, certificate designing uh, business card designing uh, it, in fact, in short, it opens for you the avenue towards graphics and design packages, which are uh, Adobe, Photoshop, CorelDRAW, and, and maybe AutoCAD. So once you study publisher uh, very well, which means and you have that uh, you, uh, that uh, urge of going for graphic design, which means it could have opened for you avenue towards knowing how to design. So Microsoft Publisher is very important in this case. And then the seventh package is about uh, Microsoft PowerPoint. Microsoft PowerPoint is the most important one because sometimes <coughs> in conferences people use this uh, Microsoft PowerPoint in terms of illustrating uh, maybe a certain project or you may be uh, a teacher and they want to teach a student and you want to illustrate uh, using a projector and with the Microsoft PowerPoint it is very easier for you uh, to teach people using it so uh, that presentation program is very important it is called MS PowerPoint sometimes it is called Microsoft PowerPoint so the eighth package on this you are supposed to understand what we call Microsoft Outlook it is good for office mailings and that is secure to send mails within the company. So understanding Outlook is very, very important. And then uh, another package is, uh, uh, is internet. Well, having studied all those 
uh, computer programs from introduction to outlook you are supposed to know how to use internet because without internet there's no way you can send message to other people there's no way you can send mails to other people so when you are left in the office you are supposed to use internet your boss has said that uh, he needs a copy of something through the email how are you going to send uh, to send that uh, that that document when you have not started uh, uh, internet so you are supposed to know more about internet so it's just a, a simple basic uh, internet appliance that you are supposed to know you are supposed to know how to use mails how to send how to search information online and uh, how to do with uh, to deal with some sites which are important within the company or anywhere that you will be uh, using sometimes in campuses you are supposed to know how to research some uh, topics about and and the work that you are given and internet does it better and then uh, the number 10 of it is about um, uh, typing skills well having studied all those other programs you're supposed again to come to the typing skills you're supposed to know how to type faster because uh, wherever or whenever you will be going and uh, maybe you have got a job people will not be waiting for you uh, with your slow typing skill you are supposed to type faster and then you submit the work faster so you are supposed to type faster and this typing skill will help you to type faster and then you deliver the work on time and uh, this typing skill also goes hand in hand with what we call the secretarial whereby you will be able now to finalize with uh, printing if uh, the institute that you are learning these particular packages has a printing machine you are supposed to know how to print how to scan and uh, those things are very important because they will help you a lot so having studied all that that is what we call computer packages so at the end of all this you are supposed to be given a certificate and that certificate you are supposed to use it either as a receptionist or in any office that they need somebody who is a computer literate somebody who knows computer basics yeah there are people who ask me uh, this particular question now having learned these packages where am i going to use them well you can use it in offices you can be given a job in any office it will accompany your form 4 certificate so some some of the people think that once they they get form 4 certificate they have got qualification my friend you are very far from that you are not qualified in anything you only sat for kcsc but you don't have any experience in anything so when you add something to do with the computer which means you have experience in computer in computer application because computer has so many uh, programs so for you to study all those programs sometimes it will take you like four years maybe you go to up to degree level or diploma level so with these certificates you are supposed only to study what we call bits by bits and then you get certificate and that is it at the end of the day you are supposed to know how to use computer somebody can employ you anytime yeah that is how uh, computer application does thank you so much for listening and being part of my channel remember to subscribe see you in the next video